I will show how the, some different ways how to cut this cable. This is uh, equivalent to the LMR, uh, sorry, LMR 400 from Times Microwave Systems. Uh, this is uh, not that brand cable. We are using a cheap one. So I will show how it will be if we use the very simple method to cut the cable. Cut here. Okay. What we can see is that the cable is completely smashed. Okay. So you can see that the cable is completely smashed, and this will create some problems in very high frequencies. So we need to uh, cut it a little better. Okay. So. One option is to use uh, um, a plier like this, that when where the blades are curved around, so we'll get a very a much better cut. I will just do that here. Okay. Okay, it's much much better now. Much sharper cut and uh, we if we didn't have this thing we could also use this that uh, fits for several purposes one of them is to cut so I will just put here in the cutting part apply some pressure rotate it like so check if it is on the right spot yes it is okay right spot like this I need to apply some pressure okay it's I think the only thing remaining is the core I can take all this the core is here but if I bend it a little it will just break okay and here we have a almost perfect sharp cut a very good quality cut and um, this could be used for really very high frequencies we know that without any problems for other frequencies for I don't know maybe above 10 gigahertz maybe we have to uh, give uh, even better cut but for most purpose this is plainly okay